What's up, guys? I am back after like a three week hiatus. Um, I really just don't have any other places to shoot videos right now. I can't do it in my basement. Uh, my basement's pretty much getting redone. And um, soon I'll be able to Skype if you want to add me on there. Big Bernie Cool 72, that's my Skype name. I'll be able to do that in a couple weeks as well. And um, here it is eBay unboxing for some WWE DVDs. I've already opened some, so there's no bubble wrap in it at all. Uh, I just kept... Um, I think I started watching the Ultimate Warrior one that I got. And uh, I'm just keeping it all the DVDs in here for now. So I guess this is kind of like my unboxing here. So let's open these babies up. I know you can't really see right now. Let's see. Uh, do the first couple at a time. Um, first one is Grandmasters of Wrestling, unopened, still with the plastic on it. I don't think I'll ever watch this, to be honest. I've got a lot, a lot better DVDs to watch yet. So, um, yeah, I probably won't watch that. Um, I already have this one, Stone Cold, Legacy of Stone Cold Steve Austin. There's that. Um, actually, before I trade it to, like, a Mega Media... The one in Green Bay, the one in my town got closed down actually, or uh, Pond America. Uh, if you want to trade this for something, I'd be down. Just message me. I already have this. Um, I paid like fourteen dollars total for the slot, which I think is a really good deal. Um, next one, the Unreal Story of Pro Wrestling. I guess it was nine ninety nine at some point. What a rip off. I don't know if I'll ever watch this. I mean, I guess it might have some old school, um, uh, this thing will focus anyway. Let's see here. Come on. There it is. Yeah, maybe some really, really classic, like, gotch classic, like, wrestling, but I don't know if I'll really watch that ever. Uh, next one, we have the, a, uh, WWF one. Stone Cold Steve Austin, what? Guess it's from Blockbuster. It's a WWF uh, DVD, in fact. So that. Uh, let's see how far it was. Here's the spine. You can see that at all. But yeah, Stone Cold Steve Austin, what? WWF DVD, which is pretty sweet. Next one, I have not had this one yet. But the Andre the Giant uh, DVD. Just called Andre the Giant, I guess. Uh, I don't even know if I'll ever watch this. Maybe if it has a doc, a documentary at all, maybe I'll watch it. Maybe I'll watch it get uh, hyped for the Andre the Giant Battle Royal or whatever. That will probably flop again. Next one, let's see here. Oh, yeah, I don't know why this is just separate from uh, the collection. This is just disc three of, like, probably three disc set, I'm guessing. But this is the... Um, uh, probably the set out of it that I'd be most familiar with. So I was a big fan from W or of WWE from 2005 to 2008. This has a couple years before that. I know a lot about that. This might be a fun watch sometime. I don't know what I'm going to do if I get the full three disc set. But yeah, here's all the chapters and stuff. Looks pretty promising. Let's see, next one. WWE. Hulk still rules. Two disc set. Uh, Voice of Voices says that uh, it's pretty good. So, yeah. And plus I got it with the other WWF uh, DVD. Uh, I'll probably actually check this out sometime. Just old school. What, what year is this from? Uh, uh, 2002, this thing will focus. Yeah, there it is, 2002. So yeah, I might watch this sometime. There's that. Hulk still rules. Let's see, two more left. Oh, the classic Beyond the Mat. The movie Vince McMahon doesn't want you to see. On an unrated director's cut, I, I don't know if I have this one yet. I have to check sometime. But yeah... I've heard this one's pretty good. Kind of blocks the subheading over there, but yeah. I mean, I'll probably watch this at some point if I get bored. 
Uh, I have spring break next week, so uh, I'll pl I plan on doing a lot of stuff during that. Um, let's see, next one. Really, my first shoot interview um, uh, DVD from RF Video, Jeff Hardy. I think this one's this one's from like early 2000s. Does um, it even say on here? I think it's from like 2003, maybe. Um, yeah, I haven't watched it. Voice of Voices said it was good, or he heard it was good. So I might check this out sometime when I have like three hours to kill. So yeah, there it is. RF Shoot Interview Series. Jeff Hardy. And the last one is buried in here. Just like Axel Mania got buried. It is the self-destruction of the Ultimate Warrior. I have been looking for this one ever since Warrior died. And I know the price for this has just gone up. Here it is. I finally have it. I'm currently watching it right now. Um, should be interesting to see this compared to the um, other... What's it called? Other uh, feature that WWE is going to do on Ultimate Warrior coming out soon. So, yeah, here's all the stuff I got right here. Let's go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine different DVDs, some three disc sets, some two disc sets. Um, and again, I'm willing to trade that Stone Cold Steve Austin for pretty much anything I don't have, I guess. Yeah, I think I paid like 14, 15 bucks for this, maybe. I'll check up on that. But yeah, I got all of this for that. I feel pretty proud of myself. eBay can sometimes be a gold mine if you could find it. Kind of like Pawn America in real life for me. So yeah, there's that. And then again, like I said, next week I have spring break. I am not going anywhere this year. But next year, you're damn sure that I'm going to be in Dallas for WrestleMania 32. Crew 32, baby. See you guys later.